Hello everybody, my name is FredX and welcome back to Star Sector. So, we're actually starting to get ourselves a quite a little nice fleet at this point. And I'm actually going to go off and try and do some more bounties nearby. So there's actually two in this nebula over here, which is pretty handy. The Chief of our Nebula. There's uh, also seen Emmanuel and Hijack. <laughs> that sounds to me more like a bounty name if you ask me than it is a random normal name. But whatever, I'm not going to judge these people's names. What, what can I say? Uh, before I leave though, I was actually going to get myself a cargo ship as well. So we can carry more goods with us. I'm actually going to just buy one from the black market. I did check there is a buffalo here. Now I'm pretty sure if I just... Is there a tug here as well? No, there's not. But I, if I modify the hole, it should be able to fly around quicker than it should normally be able to. Uh, so we do that. Is there anything else I could use to increase the speed? No. <laughs> not really, no. Uh, let's just give it some random stuff. Let's auto fit it. It'll be fine. You can figure it out, game. <laughs> do it for me. Uh, apart from it took away my military systems, which is kind of sad. Okay, done. So, let's get us ourselves some fuel and cargo and let's head off, shall we? Now, as you can tell, we can now get a lot more stuff for what we used to be able to have. We can have loads of cargo space now, loads of fuel, which is really handy. I don't want to spend all my money on it, though, of course, because uh, it's a bit ridiculous. <laughs> ah, yes, I want to have, uh, like, 10 years supply of fuel. What did that say at the top? Oh. Ah, your fleet batches the profile. Oh, no. <clears throat> yeah, sure. Oh, they didn't find me. Cool. <laughs> I may have bought that cargo vessel at the black market, but luckily, once again, we've locked out and they haven't found us. So <laughs> why am I so lucky with this? Normally, I normally buy like one, like one little like potato and they're like, we caught you, sir. You're going down. <laughs> anyway, let's move on, shall we? So let's get myself into cruise mode. And let's head off towards the bounties. There are some pirates in the system still, but as we discovered yesterday um, or whenever it was, there was a lot of um, wait. I say this. Is that a... Oh, no. If I fight guys just outside system like here, I think it still counts as part of the bounty. But all these guys are also mercenaries. So <laughs> this place has so well, so many mercenaries, I can't even do anything. Ooh, uh, let's try and thread the needle. Let's make our way over to the objective. Oh, some of these bounties are getting pretty big. Zoom. Oh, look at that guy's fleet. That's ridiculous. Oh, it's worth 200k. Okay, that's probably why. <laughs> I can't kill that, everybody. There's a pirate fleet. Hmm, I think we we're going to try and kill this, everybody. <laughs> Screw it. It would be totally fine. Don't worry about it. Believe, everybody. Believe. Okay, this is a big fleet. Um, I say this, though. It is a pirate fleet. No, no, they're scavengers. So it's kind of like a hybrid between a mercenary and a pirate. I guess they want to try and scavenge me, which is not exactly a good thing. Um, let's see, moving to engage. It's got, it reminds me kind of like Kenchi when you have like the, what they call the slaver guides and they try and just randomly attack people to get more slaves. <laughs> it's like, guys, that's not the plan. Okay, we're going to pull the entire fleet. We do only have frigates. Um, I'm sure we'll be fine. I'm not going to give any orders yet. We're going to see what's going to happen first. Uh, I'm not sure how strong they're going to be. We're just focused on killing all these little ships first. Oh, I'm not worried about that. It'll be fine. Oh, there's some fighters. Let's, let's kill these because my guys aren't that good at point defense. Okay, I'm going to go for this guy. Hello there. <laughs> I love this. This is... A, I love it. I love it. Oh, no, they got torpedo bombers. As we discovered the other day, torpedoes can kill you in one hit. Oh, no, 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 no. It's okay. Don't panic. We have the power of Terminator drones. Who did that? That was this guy. I'm going to take this. Why is the carry on the front lines, everybody? They've not done a good job here. Oh. Broadswords. No, oh, are they broadswords or are they talons? They're a type of fighter, by the way. I know what I'm talking about. Don't worry. <laughs> you have no idea what I'm talking about, but I do. Oh, no. They've discovered that they actually want to protect the carrier and they've sent some reinforcements. Okay, so far it looks like everyone's just split out and done, doing their own thing. Uh, these two are kind of just going to retreat, I think, backwards while being attacked. I'm going to probably distract this middle force here. I'm actually going to ask what we do. We're going to split this. So I'm going to say to you two, just focus fire on these two units. That will probably mean they move away from this freighter and I will have to take the entire middle formation by myself. 
I'm not of course going to fight them, but it just means I'll be able to strap them. Because if we can try and take care of all the outlying ships, then we can try and get these guys to go around the flank and attack the carriers at the back while I'm trying to strap the main force. Well, as like I said earlier, though, these guys are going to just pull back. They actually have the capital ship on them. Actually, can we look at it with the... There's a way you can, like, zoom in, isn't there? Oh, it's probably because it's an enemy ship. If I do this, though, if I press F to pay respects, you can see this is a cruiser, everybody. This is actually a very decent cruiser. I think a lot of um, fleets have this because it's, it's, it's technically like an old mining vessel, but it's such a big tanky ship with so many weapon mounts. It's actually a really good choice if you're like trying to find a big, um, we're trying to find a capital ship if you're needing. Anyway, now I reckon I can um, quickly gank this guy. Hello there, let's go. Oh no, I was a bit too aggressive. We rammed him. <laughs> Take him out. Oh no, there's a phase frigate. These are very annoying. Uh, if you try and shoot it, it does this. Now the way to deal with this though is just to do this. You just look at it. You just wait until the phase runs out. Ooh. So to quickly explain that, instead of having a shield, they can go invisible. Well, they go into a different reality. Reality itself bends to their will. Oh, I'm getting a bit dodgy, but you're Oh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Luckily, this ship is extremely fast. We've got to bear in mind, if I was in like a destroyer or a cruiser, that would be very bad. You want to make sure you guys have protection, because that would be very bad. Okay, he seems to be by himself. Let's, let's, let's sit on him. Ah. You can only hide for so long, sir. I gotta say that is a, that was a course of phase ship, but that was one of the basic ones. I think it was just a pirate version actually. There's some really annoying ones you can find later on, which are just horrible. There's even a phase destroyer, which is terrifying because no one can kill it. Yeah, how's the main battle looking? Oh, that's kind of annoying to be honest. You guys are just being attacked over there, so I'm gonna tell you guys just to re. Wait, actually, what we do? One of you harass that ship to keep it distracted. You go and reinforce. No, actually, I don't think you need to reinforce. Move down here and help me engage these carriers. Because I think there's a carrier here and there's a like a carrier here. They're going to be by themselves. So if we try and push put pressure on them, I can then focus on winning without these guys trying to kill me all the time. Oh, I can't wait to get our own fleet, everybody. It's going to be amazing. Like, not just frigates, like big stuff. Oh, no. This is the downside of having frigates, everybody. Our CR goes down very quickly. You killed my drone! Avenge your brother! You'll, you'll pay for this. Oh, finish it. Good job, good job. Okay, um, I got back up on my way. That guy's distracting. They have killed those guys. If you guys can just go and gank that unit. I think at this point in the battle, because we the CR is going down, it's going to tick down slowly, but I have got every single ship has a reduction in how fast it ticks down. And also, there's only seems to be, what, two carriers, the capital ship, and a random destroyer left. So it should be okay if we just quickly move around and kill the targets. I want to go in. This guy should be easy to kill. He's literally a freighter. They just put a hang hanging bay on it. Oh, I didn't think about that. It seems his shields are pretty good. Luckily, I ordered some backup earlier. Oh, be careful. Oh, my God. Are you okay? It's, it's merely a flesh wound. Wait, is it a flesh wound if it's a ship? Ah. It, it, the, the thing still applies. It's totally fine. Now, with my friend here, if I just do this, we should be able to hopefully take this guy down. One of us is going to be hitting it. Oh, no. No, 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 no. Those torpedoes. Ooh! It misfired. I think because I went into it from the side. I think its engine ran out. So it didn't actually. <laughs> it just bounced off me. <laughs> I'll take that as a win every. Oh, no. That's bad. Oh, no. Oh, no. Man down. Man down. I can't believe it. I can't believe it, everybody. How you will be punished with your life. I don't know how I'm going to do this yet, but we're going to figure it out. Okay. Oh, I got my shorts in. Oh, no. These are coming from the Condor, which is the other carrier over there. Now, I have asked my entire Navy to go and attack that thing. So, eventually, they will arrive and we will... Ooh. 
take it down. This is why fighters are very powerful, by the way. Um, because I said, we do have point defense. Ooh. Damn it, the hyper velocity driver is really good. They're about, they're about to arrive. They know it as well. That's why they're moving towards each other. Because they know that... Oh, that's going to be bad. I just have to shield. We might get a flux. Okay, we're fine. We're fine. Okay, they've arrived. The Condor... I actually mentioned this before. The Condor is a very basic... <laughs> very basic carrier. But it is... A good carrier if you defend it. So you can either... It depends on how you want your fleet to be. You can be very um, dynamic how you want to do stuff. You can have a very like mobile fleet like mine. Or you can have like a very like strong fleet that just moves forward and attacks the enemy. We just use another wolf. These torpedoes things are a nightmare. Okay, they're dead though, they're dead. Yeah, that was we got this this battle's not been worth it at all. We're gonna try and recover those ships after as we can, but that this has not been a good battle. This has been a disaster. Okay, they're dead. Uh everyone go and engage the final vessel. Can you help me, please? I'm being attacked by this talent. <laughs> please help me. Somebody help me. Okay. Thank you, thank you. Okay. Unfortunately, because I think we've lost like three or four drones at this point. We don't seem to have... Oh, no, they are regenerating, but it's a very 58% regenerate rate. It's a bit slow. Okay, so we've lost two units. We have some left. I thought we might have to pull back after this and uh, repair, because <laughs> I wasn't expecting this type of battle. Okay. Enemy spotted. I'm also very injured as well. We can't forget that. These are not fighters, by the way. These are mining drones, so... Everyone seems to be very scared of this ship. I'm not surprised, to be honest, because it is very powerful. It looks... What's it got on it? Two anti-shield, a pulse laser, and a bunch of missiles? I'm just not sure what type of missiles they are, to be honest. I'm going to apply pressure up the north. Also, we've got to be very careful because that these anti-shield ones will just destroy us. Oh, we got it, we got it, we got it. Probably the best thing I can do at this point is actually not to fight, is to do this. Ah, oh, it blocked the last one. I'm going to try and spread myself around a little bit. If we can take out this engine, this, this thing is very tanky. <laughs> This is what I was on about further. This is a very good ship. If you want, if you're like early game and you want like a good center of your fleet. Ooh, that's close. I'm going to vent and go back in. Ooh! I don't know what that was, but it didn't hit me. <laughs> no. Okay. Oh, it's just like a, that's a rocket launcher. The thing is, we will eventually kill it. You think you're not doing damage. Once we get through the armor, which is the yellow HP, it will start taking damage. But getting to that point is a bit hard, as you can see. Uh, looking at the overlay, this bit here is weak, and the back left's weak as well. So I'm going to try and focus on the top, uh, this bit here, because it seems to be the weakest point at the moment. It's about to go down. But I'm worried about all my CRs going down across my fleet. It's getting quite dangerous, actually. But if we lose this, they can harass us. So I don't want that to happen. Oh, we got it. We got it. It's going red. We're in. Luckily, I'm very good at destroying this guy's shield. So I'm going to keep moving in and out with the flux. The CR is getting very low though. We might lose this. We have to be very careful here. Okay, it's starting to go down. This is why you can't just have frigates, by the way, because as soon as you get to large ships like this, you are going to struggle like this. This is a big struggle. But imagine, this is just one ship, by the way, we're trying to fight down. This is not even a good cruiser. Well, it is, it, uh, it is a good cruiser. I mean, it's not like a military cruiser. It's just a civilian cruiser. Oops, sorry about it. This guy's engines aren't even working anymore because everything's falling apart. 
We will win. I don't care how long it takes. This is completely going to bankrupt us, though, with the uh, supplies and stuff. <laughs> we will win. Dude, I wish you could launch your missiles. Actually, I don't think he has any left. Good damage. Good damage. We're trying to escape. <gasps> it got to the edge of the map. No way. It got away. I can't believe it. I didn't even notice it was moving that way. Wow, that was awesome though. We got 196% more XP from that battle because it was a hard battle. Uh, I feel like we can no longer... En we can't engage. We can't engage. Actually, I can do it myself. I'm going to attack by myself. Only I can attack. Everyone else is completely devastated. I'm going to go for that cruiser. We're going to try and take it down. As you can see, because we're doing an attacking mission where we're chasing somebody, you can see all the civilian ships and ships that have retreated are now going to run, run away. Now, normally what would happen is the uh, combat ships will try and defend the civilian ships. But in this situation, I'm going to be trying to kill their capital ships. So that's going to be my mission. I'm also very injured. <laughs> it's okay. Don't worry about it, everybody. Don't worry about it. So as you can see right away, this is a, a military ship from before. It's moved to engage me. I'm going to go in right away and take it down. I don't want to risk getting too close to that one, so enemy down. Okay. Should I just... How long have we got? <clears throat> I made this, uh, don't worry about me. Just going to... Hi, friend. It's a nice weather we're having. Of course, with how this game works, the the loot is literally inside these ships. If you let it go, it will just escape. <laughs> now nah, it's going to take too long. I, I just want to kill the cruiser. We'll kill this guy because I've already started doing it. Go, go, go. So as you can see, though, we are struggling quite a bit. Imagine if I had like a fast carry or something or like... Um... Or like a fast destroyer. It's gonna be. It's gonna be big. Prepare your eyes, everybody. Prepare your eyes. Ah! Oh. <laughs> I'm blind. It's okay. We're moving in. Now this guy is weak everywhere. Apart from he's got a little bit of arm on the front. You can see it just. But oh, can I do this by myself? I didn't think about this. I don't think I can. I've messed this up. He has is a cruiser shield. There's no way I'm going to be able to take him down. Ah, oh, damn it. I completely messed this up. I did not think about this at all. Um, what we can... We can at least try, though. Yeah, there's no chance. No chance. Okay, we're just going to let this guy go. He may not even retreat because I'm pretty weak. <laughs> I'm just going to pull back myself and he should just leave. I didn't think about that. Of course, I wanted to try and kill him, but the chart, the me versus him solo, I didn't think I got the capability to take that guy down. But we destroyed one of their fuel transports and a frigate. So, um, <laughs> that poor man. I should, oh, I should have just gone through all his cargo vessels and stuff. So it's just him escaping. Of course, as well, if you take down all the support units, he won't be able to supply himself as well. So it works that way. Uh, how far have we got to go? Quite far. That was a big battle, everybody. That was really fun. I, I probably could have done a little bit. I could have done a better job there, everyone. But I just had a good time doing it. We, of course, did lose two wolves. But I think we might be able to recover them as story points. So I think it would be worth doing that. Um, claim victory, yes. Consider ship recovery, yes. Oh, yeah. One of them was my uh, unique one as well. Okay, so we're going to recover both those vessels. They are going to be really bad shape. And we need to pull back to... Ooh, we can... These are my ships, right? These are my ships. I'm kind of interested to see if I can maybe grab this... No, we, we, we got too many wolves. <laughs> we need to focus on big ships, everybody. This battle has proven to us that we need bigger ships. Because it has caused us some issues here. Uh, recover those two ships. Perfect. Everyone, no one died. <laughs> they may have been split in half temporarily, but they didn't die. Okay, it's fine. We just, we just duct taped it back together. 
Now, as we have destroyed this guy, pit through wreckage. Ooh, loads of supplies. Probably not enough to recover what we spent in the combat, though, to be honest. And we got some stuff here. So, I think the main thing for that battle was probably going to be the XP in this... Yeah, the XP, I would say. Now, what do we do now? What do we do now? We're going to have to pull back and repair, I think. I'm also going to have a look around here. I'm kind of curious. What do we want to try and get next? I kind of want to go for the movement speed one here. So, navigation. 30%... Uh, negative 30% terrain movement penalty from all applicated... Uh, app yeah. Applicable <laughs> terrain and plus one maximum burn level. That is very handy. And also sustained burn is increased by one as well. So really it's plus two we get, which is really handy. Um, also, yeah, yeah, I'm going to go for this. I'm going to go for this. Later on, we might go for something like... Oh, that's really good. All the skills seem very good, everybody. I'm not going to lie. The, scene, the skills are just overall looks good to me. Like this one, for instance, I normally get pretty as soon as possible. It's like... 100% targeting leading accuracy for auto-firing weapons. That's amazing for your own ship. Only for, only for your own ship. And also increase your range. That's also very effective. So like for now, and also ECM as well. ECM is very cool, by the way. ECM means that the enemy loses weapon range. So it, like there's so many things you can do in this game to make your fleet better. It's just amazing. I can't fanboy about, about this game enough, everybody. <laughs> I can't handle it. It's too good. I can't take it anymore. Anyway, uh, let's move on. Yeah, I think we go for that, and next we go for the tar targeting accuracy. Can you get both of these? You can, you can. Oh, this is a fleet one. I refill it because I do normally. I used to know what these all did, but I think these moved stuff around recently, so I'm a bit. Like, for instance, this one here, you can control AI ships. That wasn't in the game before, I'm pretty sure, so that's epic. Um, <laughs> i got to stop fanboying everybody. The fanboys too much. We can um, probably stalk this guy for a little bit. Let's just um, save anyway, because that was a big battle. Uh, we're going to stalk him. He's trying to avoid me, but he doesn't actually realize I'm just waiting for my ships to repair. <laughs> I do love how ships repair as well. Like It's cool how they like fill themselves in. But these ships are having a bad time. Did anyone level up, by the way? They didn't level up. Disappointing. I'm disappointing all of you. Every single one of you. I reckon we should just pull back, to be honest. It's going to take way too long to take this guy. I don't know, but the cruiser, though. I would love it if we can, like, capture or something. I don't think he can... Uh, I think his problem is he's always oh, pirates outside there now. It does take a while to repair, unless you have, like, some kind of, like... Uh, wait, what's that? Oh, that's just... Uh, oh, they're going to kill him. Let's head back. So, of course, repairing does take a long time, but of course, you can also repair just inside a, a repair dock or something. It's not a problem. Where even am I? I don't know. Little patrol vessel there. Ooh, that's a pretty ice... Look how pretty that is. Oh, I keep driving in asteroids, everybody. I, I think that's random, by the way. When You, you don't actually drive into them. Where should, do you? Maybe, maybe they changed it. No, they don't. It's just random. I think if you're there, you get a chance to run into one. Um, like, like there. <laughs> and I think with me, it just it happens every time because it's me. Um, okay. We are a bit worse aware when it comes to money right now. That's all we need to go and get those bounties. We cannot afford to do a lot here when it comes... Okay, repair. 260 left. That's fine. We've got loads of supplies left. We That's, that's more than enough. I will keep these ships with me. Oh, what are these? Another Tempest. Oh, if only I had more money. More Tempest would be epic. But no, we try, I think we need to save up. We need to get ourselves a destroyer, which is the next level up. So, um, none of these are destroyers. <laughs> Nothing here is a destroyer, everybody. Damn it. I think the only way forward at this point is if we carry on with our mission... We try and take down these two bounty targets. Both of them look pretty easy, to be honest. And um, then we can get the money to try and maybe invest in a frigate. Oh, what's, my, what's my speed now? 20. Super speed. We're just so fast. Can't handle it. I swear I was aware. There was somewhere at some point where you can see how many supplies you have. For like days. That'd be pretty handy. But I guess it does change all time. Like if I just crash into one of those, it's gonna mess it all up and everything, so. Oh. 
Avoid the storms. Avoid the storms, everybody. Athena repair complete distress call. Not interested. <laughs> okay, we're here. Um, where are you, sir? Where are you? He is rumored to be hiding out near a barren bombard world in a system with a dwarf primary star. Okay, dwarf primary star. Where has a dwarf primary star? Um, everywhere. <laughs> well, I guess it's going to be one of these two. Let's go for this one first. When... Wendigo? <laughs> oh no! <laughs> we don't want to go over there. Oh no, what's that? That's just a random fleet? Prospector. Ooh, what is this? Random dormant ships. Phantom class phase trans. I've never even seen. What is this? High tech. No, I want to see it, game. I want to see it in its glory. Let me see it in its glory. How do I do that again? There's a way you can look, look at... Um... Oh, I can't remember where it is. Codex. Ship holes. Is it Phantom? It's Phantom, isn't it? I want to see what it looks like when it's not completely destroyed. That's, that's not it. Oh, sorry. <laughs> oh, that is pretty. Look at this. Ah, an advanced troop transport employed phase self technology. Ah, how cool is this? Whole mods, phase shield, delicate machinery, advanced ground supports. So I think it improves like uh, attacking people with mer uh, merchants. <laughs> take that merchant with um, marines. That's really cool. We're not gonna take it with us. We're gonna. Uh, oh no! Wait, salvage it. That is cool though. I never seen one of those. Um, okay. It's not here. This is the wrong place. Oh, well, there is something here. What is this? This random we weapon catch? Ooh. There's a kite. I don't want that. <gasps> a railgun blueprint. So this doesn't really help us now, but one day it means we'll be able to build railguns. Oh, and also the Thunderwing. <gasps> yes. Uh, the Thunderwing is a great fight, everybody. The Thunderwing is amazing. So I think Thunderwing, if you know I like quality, right? You probably discovered right now I like quality ships. Uh, this is a quality fighter. Uh, you can see it's extremely fast, well armed, and with a long engagement range. I think they actually have mass drivers in them or something like that. Um, they're, they're they're great. They are great. I, I'm I'm super hyped. I'm I'm a, I'm over the moon, everybody. Over the moon. There's a rogue right there. Oh yeah. That was totally worth it. Okay, uh, so this is the wrong place, but we, of course, found some epic blueprints. Of course, when you actually get your own faction, you're, um, they build their own ships, but if you haven't got the blueprints, they, don't, they can't build anything. <laughs> so you literally would have started with like, some awful ships that barely even function with like no weapons, because that's just what you can build. What is that? I don't think that's nice, whatever that is. Should we scan it? Oh, it's just, um, oh, it's too far away. We need to get, we need to get, like, a sensor ship or something. Wait, what did that say? Oh, pfft. Hostiles. I'm not worried about a single frigate, man. Are you mad? A jungle. Oh, what is a jungle? Let's do a quick scan, though. Make sure there's nothing big nearby. Nope, we're good. Okay. Baron Bombard World. Khufu. <laughs> I feel like that might be our target, everybody. Oh, sorry, I'm not going full speed. There you go. Oh, there's somebody. They're here. You want to indirect me? I'm just going to fly into you. Okay. we got to bear in mind our ships are damaged. So we got to be a bit careful here. In fact, no, we, we've deployed the entire force. I don't, I probably should have checked what issues these, the two damaged ships had. I don't know what they got wrong with them. So, oh. Oh, no, 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 no. I'm going to get rid of this guy immediately. Yes, you can phase. I can see that, friend. You can definitely phase. Oh, no. Dead. Oh, that's bad. There's two wings of fighters on their way. Um, how do we want to... Oh, no! Oh, no, no, no. They're pretty scary, they are. 
How do we want to deal with this situation, everybody? How do we want to deal with it? So I reckon we should tell someone to harass that ship for now. Personally, I would rather the shuttle harass it. Actually, is the shuttle faster than the wolves? It should be. Top C, 140. I think it's slower than the wolves. It is. Okay, yeah, you harass that then, friend. Uh, we need to clear out of the, the field. Hmm. You guys engage. Just engage that, that group of enemies there. You can kind of help me over here. Um, yeah, so what we're going to do is set two engage orders. Engage are kind of a general order, by the way. So when I say engage, it doesn't just... Actually, it says right here. Your fleet will engage the target in any nearby ships. So we can kind of have like two little battle groups here. So I can say, you help me here attack this group. And you guys attack that group. I don't know how long the radi big the radius is, but the AI is very intelligent. So I'm just worried about this guy surviving here. Now, he is actually top speed 140, which is 10 less. In theory, this ship should be able to pull back and stay at range. I'm really worried about it, though. So we're actually going to head over there quickly and make sure it doesn't die. Yeah, it's a trouble. The ship's in... Oh, wait. That's why it can't caught up. That is why. Okay. Um, plan B. He should be okay. He can phase away if he needs to. And I told him to harass, which means he will not prioritize fighting. He will prioritize distracting. And luckily for us, it's the it's the wolf with the giant long-range laser on it. So that's really handy. Okay, let's focus on these guys. Oh, Cerberus. Messed up. Okay. That guy probably should retreat now because he's just taking a big clump over. Oh, that's bad. Ooh. Oh, that, look at that big gun on that one. That's huge. I love these pirate ships. They're so cool. Okay, we're pretty looking pretty good here. Oh, my guy just ran off to... I forgot to assign the order to help me. Um, do you know what? If you don't want to help me, you don't have to. Okay, I'll just take care of all of it myself. I see how it is. To be fair though, I am better equipped to deal with these guys because I do have a uh, a tempest. So, oh no, the flux. That was a bit close there. I'm not gonna lie. Let's try and push in. One good hit on this guy, you go down. Perfect. Ooh, that's a big ship up there. Okay, so you guys, everyone's now engaging this group. What happened to the, um... Oh, he's been, he's been pushed back to the edge of the map. <laughs> we need to deal with that guy. Oh, I'm actually kind of worried, because if he's on the edge of the map, he might get stuck. It is, unfortunately, a possibility. Um... Oh, no! <laughs> Just flying around. We need to wrap this up quickly. I'm going to change orders, I think. Oh, no, he's he got, he got around it. It's fine, he's fine. Um, how do we want to deal with this? We keep fine like this. Actually, I think we could. He's escaped. He he just, he just keep running away, and we can take care of the rest of the fleet while they're distracted. This is kind of like a a cruiser carrier, but it's just a freighter. It's not a big combat ship. It has got a lot of guns on it, though. I think. That's how this game is so cool as well. Ooh. Because as well, like, you can have different ships that can have completely different weapon capabilities. Oh, that was bad. Oh, I don't like that gun. I don't like you, sir. You're going down. Ooh, that's not good for me. Okay, done, done, done. Let's go engage that. Oh, we're starting to run out of a uh, thing though, which is a bit annoying. This is why you normally, if you want to have a lot of frigates, you want to have them... I have them in control groups already, I haven't done it yet. Uh, you're meant to deploy them in phases. That's what I normally do. Uh, so I have like two wolf packs, so I deploy them in different phases. Now we should all be moving to attack this guy. He's got stuck again, hasn't he? Oh no. After this, we should all go and engage the main guys. This speeds up a little bit. 
two good hits there. That was really nice. These, I don't know when he changed them to be missiles, but that's such a cool idea. Okay. Now, without doing anything, everyone should now go and engage that last ship. Let's go, fleet. Oh, my fleet's so awesome. Let's go, team. Of course, I am by far the fastest ship here. <laughs> if I actually managed to get the blueprint for the Tempest, by the way, that'd be amazing. I'd just get, like, 20 Tempest. <laughs> well, of course, that won't be my main fleet, of course. I'd just, like, I'd just get Tempest so we can um, not be alone. Okay, the enemy squad. Oh, he's running away. Yeah, he's legging it. I'm going to see if I can get around the back of him. And then my guys will come from the other side. And we can hopefully get ourselves a nice flank there. Oh, he knows on the main threat still. Okay, I'm going to go engage. This is a tough ship though, this is a tough ship. Quick, quick. I was going to press F there, but it didn't work. <laughs> I didn't have enough flax to launch my drone. That went very well. One guy escaped. Unacceptable. Unacceptable. I will kill him myself. With my super speed tempest. You think you can escape me? You've made a grave mistake. How far did these go before they ran out of burn -out? Not very far, okay. <laughs> Turns out that was not a good idea. I thought they were going to chase them down to the end of time. We're kind of equal when it comes to this now, because like, I haven't got my drones. <laughs> Damn it! I may have made a mistake. Also, I'm, asset, I'm using the pulse laser. I shouldn't have been doing that, my bad. Um, I can fix that, though, so I haven't got to worry about switching over. I was only using one weapon, that's why. There you go. He's a bit annoying though, isn't he? Can you just die, sir? Victory. These poor drones. I'm happy that they're not manned. <laughs> go, drone! Go! <laughs> Kill them all! Okay. First bounty has been eviscerated. And we can even take all this cargo of us, which is probably not going to be worth much money, but we'll take it anyway. Okay, oh, level up the four Callist. I need to change your name. I, I, I don't like it. I'm sorry. <laughs> Imagine being hired by someone like that. I don't like your name. I'm going to change it. Um, I'm, so, I'm sorry. <laughs> okay. Damage control, combat endurance, ordnance expertise, or point defense. Now, I you probably know what I'm going to pick, right? I like this one. Combat endurance, which I have on my own character, of course. More operating time. Less degradation, more combat readiness. Yes. Beautiful. Good job, Diana. What is the XP rate? Oh, look at what is look, look at it's ridiculous. Look at this. What are the I can't believe it. <laughs> 159,544 out of 160,000 XP. Damn it, Gamal. You've been you're being shown up here by four Callisto. Okay. You're messing up, sir. You're messing up. You're not gonna get destroyed at this rate. You're all going to get destroyed after she is. You've got to set, set things up. Okay, what was wrong with these ships, by the way? I didn't actually check. Um, it's just... Okay, it's just awful. It's got awful AI. This one's got awful shields, and it's also got structural damage. Not that bad, but of course we will fix it as soon as possible. Uh, enemy down. Is that the other one? That would be... If they're both here, that would be amazing. It's the other one! <laughs> Let's wait a few seconds, though. Uh, wait, is he scared of me? He's maintaining contact. Okay. They could have attacked me at the same time. Pretty bad. Also, I do want to look at this jungle uh, place. Oh, I haven't got enough crew. Oh. I wanted to see if it was habitable. And we could have made a colony here. Oh, no. It's not very good, though. Oh, that's... A, it's, it's got one good trait. But overall, you are... There's some planets that have different values. Like, anything, like, under 100 is epic. Uh, really. This is not one of those places, though. <laughs> if I can, I want to find like an ocean world. I love oceans. I'm Aquarius, so um, I have to have an ocean as my capital if we can find one, and then we can start making our own uh, little empire. So, oh, I missed it. 
Look, sir, I'm poor, okay? I need more money. Give me your life. Thank you. Do you know what? I was, I was saying we should deploy them in groups, but the groups aren't... I think we need four each. Four wolves each, or like four good vessels. Uh, and also in this situation, the enemy's not that big, so we can probably just gank them with unlimited firepower. Unlimited firepower! Oh no! Oh, that's, it's got... Oh no, it's got two thumpers. Which are basically giant Gatling guns. Um, as you can just see there. Deploy the troops! Oh, damn, I missed it. So I, I, I panicked there. That's why I pressed escape. When it does burn drive, it can't use its shield. So I was going to just plow the drones into it. <laughs> we got to be very careful with our HP here. Because those, they can just kill us. we got to be careful. As we have discovered in the past. <laughs> we are a little ship. Okay, uh, can we get some guys, what we do, you guys go over there. You guys focus on that unit. So I'll, I'll basically tell my guys to ignore the big ship and go for the, uh, the ads. I will focus on this guy. I said, I will focus on, thank you. Oh, that EMP was devastating. I, I told you guys to kill this and here it is attacking me. I, I gotta say, these drones are... I, I think I might be relying on the combat drones a bit too much here. It's kind of like having a missile, but it also fights as well. I think he said everybody. I think... Oops, sorry, buddy. Oh, I, oh, I'm so sorry. <laughs> I broke your engine. I'm sorry. Okay. In my defense, you shouldn't have been there. I was, I was busy flying, and you just flew in my way. You are extremely close, sir. You're going to get destroyed by the explosion. Let's switch this over to... Uh, by the way, eliminate makes you just then just go in with all weapons. That's why they're so close. If I press engage, they will back up immediately. Unless they didn't, and they just circled around it and got blown up. But it's fine. <laughs> now, when I say blown up, you can actually take damage from ships exploding. That's why I was worried, because he could have died if he didn't have a shield up. So, that would have been very awkward. Imagine, <laughs> imagine like, losing because your ships are stupid. Um, done. Gamal leveled up. Congratulations, my friend. Okay, wait. Let me... Sometimes things work, sometimes they don't. Um, let's see. You get a new skill. Oh! Super Elite Team! Okay. Um, wh where do we go now, everybody? We got some money. Let's head back to our little homeland we decided. The Sindaria. I think that went very well. We got 140 grand now. I reckon we can ba maybe buy ourselves a destroyer. And if, if I find a good one, I can then use said destroyer instead of the Tempest. Because uh, I love a good destroyer, everybody. What the hell? What is this fleet? This fleet is huge. <laughs> I'll save because I'm going to see what it is. And we might have to reload if I die. What is this? It's gigantic. Oh, it spotted me. What is this? Oh, no. Oh, Oh wait, no, is it using some kind of like jamming? So what is, oh no, it's back. I saw this before. Oh, it's so annoying. I gotta get out of here. It led me into a storm. Oh no. Just leave me alone. Wait, what's that? We're gonna look at it anyway. There might be something cool in here. You never know. It turns out there's nothing cool in there. Okay. It's not like I, I can find random battle cruisers or anything. What are you? It is it's something that's alive. You can tell it's a fleet because it's doing this, but I just don't know what it is. Buddy, can you help me out here? There's something following me. I've got a stalker. Damn it. It must be I don't know what it is. It's very annoying. I'm gonna try and escape. Leave me alone! I don't want to buy your cookies! Please! Somebody help me! 
Uh, wasn't it doing something to me? I think it was messing with me last time. Are they going to try and engage it? They're not. What is it? Oh, what's this? A combat freighter. A lot of Vanda's ships just randomly flying around. I don't know if they're... I don't know if there's... I guess some of them are spawned in, but I think they also might just be sometimes as a battle and the ship just gets, like, thrown off. Okay, is this Sindaria? It is. Okay. I'm going to leave you alone, Stalker. Have a good day. There's apparently still a pirate problem here because there's a lot of pirates everywhere. And let's go over here. Okay, we've made it back home, everybody. We've made it back home. Uh, let's sell the goods we just made, which I think we made quite a bit of. And let's have a look at the market. Now, there's a fat... Oh, no, no. And this is a fun ship. This is a fun... It, this is the ship I would switch over to to fly myself. It is a fun one. Actually, I kind of like most of them. <laughs> I'm not going to lie. I like most ships, everybody. Uh, I do like the fast ones, of course, because they can be more maneuverable. Sunderer and the Hamhead are just fun to play. Uh, ooh, Salvage Rig. That might be handy to help repair our ships later on. I kind of want to... We're not... A... <sighs> it's kind of annoying, everybody, because because we're not commissioned by this faction they won't let me um i need five more relation points and then they let me because if you get commissioned you kind of work for them in a way uh but also it means i can then access their shops so we can see their proper military gear um which of course we can't do right now maybe we should quickly have a look around and s oh wait i was gonna repair my ships wasn't i like properly repair them not just um Is it going to cost a lot of money? Oh, that's... That's fine. There you go. Also, I should check as well. Did those... Because when you... Ships are destroyed and recovered, they might lose some weapons. Oh, they're fine. Okay. Did I give you advanced thrusters? I don't know. I might have done it at some point. That's okay, though. I'm fine with that. Uh, we're going to head over to the banner base, quickly. We're going to see if we get lucky. We might be able to fight somebody. Like them. Oh, they're not actually tagged as being hostile, so I can't attack them. There's some smugglers over there. Casually moving around human organs, because why not? I think you can only attack them when they actually go into the trade. I think that's the only way you can do it. There's multiple... Oh, what? There's a death field here. <laughs> there's all these little pirate survivors. Ah, we got one. That's a big... Can, oh wait, ooh, pirate smuggler, pursue my fleet. Now that is a proper carrier, everybody. Uh, it's not a, when I say pirate, it's, a, it's kind of like the one we fought. It's a, it's a big carrier. It's a big carrier, okay. <laughs> we see it in combat. Oh, I got backup. Friends. Moria Strike Carrier. It's a low, it's a low tech carrier, but it is a big carrier. I think it has uh, three fighter bays, which means it can have three different types of fighter in its side. It. Uh, there's also a Nava as a freighter, I guess, as a freighter. Uh, ooh, look at our backup. Our backup inv includes a light attack cruiser and an escort frigate. Ooh. I, I got I got to calm down, everybody. I got to calm down. Um, we're going to engage with just me and my friends, I think. But, oh, no, but yeah. No, we're attacking everybody. We want because if you it's kind of like battle where you share the percentage based on how well you do. So we want to make sure we get a lot of damage done here. That's the problem. There's a strike cruiser in the middle. What I'm probably gonna do is nothing. <laughs> I'm gonna go and just attack it myself. Ooh! Anti-missile, uh, anti-shield missiles. There it is. Okay, that's not that bad. It's got some warthogs, it's got some piranhas, and it, I think, a nut. K something? Curse. Caraco? Kopesh. Rocket bomber. So it's got two bombers and one heavy fighter. We're trying to get this guy out. I'm going to try and. Th engage this main carrier I think myself I'm going to tell you guys to go and engage that unit there um engage target over here 
The rest of you go and engage that group. I'll take down the middle. Oh, I just remembered. We got a backup, haven't we? This is probably going to murder that ship. <laughs> That's pretty damage, to be fair. Oh, okay. It's, it's very aggressive. <laughs> I can just feel the meat from that ship from here. It's, it's so meaty, I can tell. Oh, I forgot about the pulse laser, everybody. I got, I'll change that after this. I would like some help with this guy, because he's pretty annoying. I think that attack cruiser is a bit too slow. Oh, or not. You regain command points over time, by the way, based off various uh, thick, um, statistics and stats and stuff. So it, you can do a lot of orders if you want to. Okay. Let's move in. One wolf and the Mora class cruiser. Cruiser crack carrier, sorry. Luckily for us, because we have a lot of small ships, we're not really at danger from this carrier. I would say what would be dangerous is that attack cruiser if it was by itself. But this is a very low tech pirate weapon, so there's not far. You'll see later on when we get some like high level fighters, they can be extremely powerful. But we saw it before. Uh, they weren't. I think those are high class torpedo bombers we had to go against before. The ones that killed not one, but two of my ships. Okay, that's annoying. Uh, what we'd do. You two go and help engage that target over there. Oh, do mind for these. These can insta-pop us. Oh, it's going in. It's going full. All the bombs. Ah, oh, it's got its special skill is like a weird, like, super shield. It's not going to take much damage when it's doing that. It's kind of like temp temporary invulnerability. Well, not invulnerability, but like damage reduction. Actually very, it's actually very good at doing it, because I noticed in the past, if you fire a torpedo, it will lock, launch its skill, and it will defend itself with that skill. Because you notice it did it when that carrier got, uh, the attack cruiser got close. I mean, barely doing any damage to it right now. But the counter is probably going to be, oh, that's bad. My shields are very low right now with flux, so we want to make sure. Okay, it's fine. Good damage. Oh. My eyes. <laughs> just rammed that. Just smashed that uh, little frighter into the hole there. <laughs> Get out of my way. I don't want to deal with you. Okay, there's two enemies retreating. We're going to go and engage them. I'm also going to take... I'll, I'll be in the battle, but we're just sending my core group. We should all be faster than these ships so we can easily catch them. He's deployed deep. Why am I, why, why am I so far behind everyone else? I'll catch up. It's fine. So it's just a freighter and it's a fuel tanker. So these are not combat ships. I think he probably got more damage from that than I did. Are we done here? Yes. Nice. I, of course, inherit all their illegal woods. Uh, <laughs> do I want to use them? I don't know. We'll see how it goes. Um, I don't know if the AI would realize that I've taken all these goods, to be honest. We're going to find out what happens in a second. Oh, officer promotion. Welcome, helmsman. Steady. Oh, yes. Another steady captain. Definitely take it. Thank you, game. I appreciate it. Okay, we'll give you one of my random ships. And we have another steady captain. Beautiful. Did we not get relations from that? Oh, I don't think I did. Well, that's annoying, everybody. That's annoying. Um, we're going to go and sell these goods. 
I don't think the pirates are going to want to buy them off me. <laughs> I'm going to go and sell them at the other market, though. Because uh, there's probably less guards there. Don't mind me, friend. I'm just doing some casual smuggling. They, they they notice less if you do this kind of stuff. If you like just sell random goods. They're like, oh, is this a trader? It's just trading goods. Yeah, I'm just a casual trader. Nothing going wrong here. Oh my god, look at that money. Okay. I'm going to get in trouble for this. We had to escape. <laughs> I think I've been caught. That was a lot of money. Okay, we got to leave. We have to... Wait. I'll, I, as we're here, I just want to look at the ships we can buy, right? Yeah, I'm covering my... Oh, there's an Eagle Cruiser. It's too big, though. I... I of course, I can use it. But I mean, I... I need to escape from the smuggler, I think. But it's too big. I, I can buy it. But I won't be able to, it's going to cost all the money. I won't be able to equip it. So that's a bit sad. Uh, of course, I would love one of these. A Conquest class battleship. <laughs> I'll take it. I'll take it. Okay, I'm going to run away bravely. Get out of there! Did they catch me? They didn't notice. Nothing to see here, friends. Nothing to see here. I'm now vastly richer than I was before. <laughs> Don't worry about it, friend. Okay, there is a light cruiser here, and also, uh, I just wish I could get more relations with them, everybody. I just wish I can get more relations with them. Pretty sad, to be honest, pretty sad. I would love to get more relations with them. All right, everybody, I think, regardless, that's going to be it for today's episode. What we'll do to, uh, next time is see if we can just, we'll focus on this faction specifically. We'll see if we can get ourselves, um, um, there, ah, that's how you do it. There's a bounty to destroy a nearby guy, and it's funded by this faction. So we're going to do that next episode, and then hopefully we can get into the military market and buy ourselves some bigger ships. But everybody, apart from that, I hope that everyone has enjoyed today's episode. I know I have, and as always, please like, subscribe, and comment below, and I'll see you next time. Bye.